Hello friends, welcome back to our big data tutorial. In this video, we are going to discuss an interesting topic about Spark explain plan and we are going to do some coding and we are going to understand how this Spark explain plan is going to be performed. Let's go on detail. Here we are going to write the code step by step and then we are going to debug that. So here first I am going to create a data frame with the two columns ID and value and we are going to see what kind of explain plan will be generated. This is my favorite explain plan with the options of formatted. This is will generate the plans in two phase. One is a physical plan just providing that what it is going to be happen. And another one is a detailed physical plan about what kind of argument I am going to pass it and what kind of output I am getting from that. And here this two details we are getting from the same explain plan with options formatted. And we are going to validate this plan with physical plan in the upward direction and that details everything in the downward directions. Let me see one by one. The next step I am going to create a new data frame using with column transformations on line number 15. Now let's see how the physical plan has created. The physical plan has generated with projects and the detailed physical plan you can see this information as well as what is the input and what is the output you are going to pass it. In this you can see this one spark function you have created using with column right that also will be populated. Guys let me see an interesting use case on explain plan. I am going to create a select transformations on data frame 2 with respect to the previous data frames. This is the pipeline we have already designed but you can see the physical plan for this. It is suggesting data frame as a line number 13 we just declare right the same as been suggested. Even the detailed materialized view also we can get the same information. So what is happening inside? Catalyst optimizer is going to be evaluated and the final physical plan will be mapped with data frame 2. So data frame 2 is look like data frame 1 so it just suggested and we can use for data frame. So in detailed explain plan is a kind of extended explain plan there also you can see the analyzed logical plan both are same. From there optimized logical plan will be suggested and finally with the physical plan as a data frame of line number 13 we mentioned. So now you can understand how the catalyst optimizer is working in the backend. Now let me go and see some by transformation operations. Line number 13, I just creating the data frame 3 with some group by and collect the count values. This is has to be generated as a physical plan with hash aggregate and exchange and hash aggregate again. So exchange is a kind of shuffles. Wherever in explain plan you can see as an exchange that should be a shuffling is happen or some by transformation is going to be used it. So in detail explain plan you can get the complete information what we are going to do that what kind of input you are going to pass it and what kind of output you are getting from that all the information you can collect from here now we are going to see an additional one line for the sorting values so order by transformation i'm going to use it on line number 21 the physical plan also will be generating for the sort algorithm as well as the sort algorithm in depth detail you can see this one the, the final values so again one more step I am going to use a wide transformation as a repartitions of 4. In a physical plan you can get the collections information as an exchange as well as the more details you can get that as an exchange inputs and outputs. The argument for the repartition we are using round robin partitioning now. In a later session we can see all the types of partitionings. Here is a final summarized code which we have seen step by step before and the final physical plan information how it look like. So here you can see the physical plan information in detail the, for the entire the five steps of the code and that more details about this physical plan also provided. Hope you are able to understand how we can debug the code step by step and see the explained plan. And thanks to watching this video and please provide valuable feedbacks in comments that will help us to improve our quality.